So we are going to talk about the Madonna. Let me get this thing straight up here because get myself all set up. The Madonna has this concert, and uh, I got this sent to me on my ex. So if you want to check me out on my ex on Red Pill Love Life on X, um, no longer on um, TikTok. Um, apparently, uh, they don't like me talking about. The truth. So I got zapped on TikTok. I might put another one up later on, but it's absolutely ridiculous. But anyway, let's listen to what this uh, podcast has to say about Madonna and her um, being satanic. It's, oh, I don't know, it's pretty sat- definitely satanic, but let's check it out. Check this out. So I guess Madonna is just doing straight up satanic rituals at her concerts now? Unbelievable. This is like... So we got Madonna in the middle of a fire with people around. It's like a sacrificial. Now you know who's really being controlled in the music industry all right so it's pretty sick to tell the truth even by the look of this uh, uh, girl's name I don't know who our podcast he is but she's pretty disgusted herself and so am I Jeez, unbelievable and she even says it demon and Satan. Why is no one at this concert like, I, I'm a head out. Like, <laughs> exactly. Why would you stay after that? Ugh. It's giving the Bene Gesserit in Dune. <laughs> so we're just straight up summoning Satan. The, more like the Bene uh, Gez, uh, Jezebel. <sighs> the Jezebel. Okay, so if you want to check that out, you can check it out my... Um, my Instagram, I, I had that sent to me just last night, actually, and it was pretty uh, horrifying watching Madonna, how she morphed and changed her whole persona. When you used to love her back in the 80s, when she first was, when she sang Like a Virgin and those other borderline, very great songs back in the day, in the 80s, where I grew up in my uh, preteen years, and and seeing her evolve in, to become a demon, basically. And um, she looks absolutely horrendous. Her face looks like she's mangled up, melting. And uh, she's uh, definitely not looking good. But for this video to surface and showing it to her fans, I don't know. If you don't see that, then you must be either don't care about what she looks like or you're in part of the cult and it is a cult it's a demon cult and uh it is horrifying to see a prominent figure who i grew up with who actually liked the songs and played her music when i was playing in the clubs and now and remixing the tracks and now seeing her um being sacrificed or doing some sacrificial demonic acts on stage so it's not a good sight to see watching your so-called people that you looked up to back when you were younger and seeing her evolve into a demon damn but anyway it's uh pretty horrifying i'm gonna put this on my uh on my youtube channel but i'm gonna shade it out because of copyright reasons so you know they're very fickle on that and also my instagram how what is really going on in this world today is very, very demonic. But anyway, let's check this out. I got another one sent to me about abortions. And it is pretty horrifying. Check this I'm out. I'm Ellie. Okay. Don't feel bad. It's okay. It was a long time ago. 1962. I just thought maybe you don't know about me. My parents didn't want me anyway. The doctors worked with scientists, and they took my organs out. I 
soon as I was aborted. It had to be done right away because the organs need to be fresh. It's Ugh. okay. Horrifying. Just it even. wasn't just, just me. Just to even look there at that is horrifying. And it's, even, it's cartoon. They sent our organs to the United States for the experiment. It was my lung they ended up using. Fetal cell line WI38. 38 because that's how much experiments they did on us. Fuel cell lines are used for all kinds of things. Like vaccines. Mine was used to make MMR. You probably gave that one to your baby. I was one of the first fuel cell lines. But there's lots more from lots more babies. It's okay. I just thought maybe you haven't heard of us. Hello, I'm David. I was killed a few years after Ellie. It's okay. The doctor said my mom had psychiatric reasons to not want me. My lung made MRC5. Five because it took five babies. Perhaps you had my shots? Rabies, polio, chicken pox. Hat 293 came from me. I'm Joanna. Did you hear about me? They used my cell line just now for the COVID vaccines. Heck, human embryonic kidney. But I was in an embryo. I was three months gestation. It's okay. No one knows how many babies it took for heck to run three, but there was 293 experiments, so it was a lot of babies, and no pain medication that would ruin the cells. It's okay. I'm Jordan. They used my cell line to help with the COVID vaccines as well. Percy six. They took my eyes. <laughs> it's okay. I am Bo. In 2015, China tried something new for me and eight other babies. It's called water bag abortion keep us alive as long as possible so the organ will be fresh. My lung made the Wolvax 2 cell line. I'm not going to be the last one though. There's going to be more after me. And me. And me. And me. And me. And me. It's, it's okay. okay. It's okay. <coughs> We just thought you ought to know. Experiments were being performed on near-term alive aborted babies who were not even afforded the mercy of anesthetic as they writhed and cried in agony. And when their usefulness had expired, they were executed and discarded as garbage. In memory of Ellie, David, Joanna, Jordan, Bo, 1962. Okay. Wow. So, choice for two. All right. So, that is on my YouTube channel. I mean, my Instagram. So, if you want to check it out, I now LA TV TV podcast vlogging as well as my YouTube channel. That is pretty horrifying to watch, um, even though it is um, uh, animated and somebody did a really great job putting that together and someone sent it to me. So, keep sending it to me if i like it i'm gonna post it on my instagram and all my social medias but not tiktok i just got freaking zapped there but anyway i might open up another one um because they don't like it when i put uh, the truth content out there and obviously now i know why <laughs> but anyway on with the show and i didn't know you learn something every day i guess you just uh you just do and you see that horrifying um about full-time abortion and that's when you see how real it is and why they need it so 
Whew, I don't know how they, anybody could do that when you have a full-time abortion and you have an actual baby coming out of a woman's womb and you're cutting it to pieces and you're taking out the organs. And if that's science and if that's what you're supposed to do uh, to help humanity, but is it? Or is it just uh, another way for Moloch to grab the souls of the innocent or innocent bodies of adrenochrome? baby blood so that's what they feed um you know um the harvest of the people out there who crave it or are addicted to it usually into entertainment industry which is called idrina chrome now you see um why they are hiding and why they need it apparently it's a big thing in hollywood I did it in my prior either uh, podcast, and uh, which got censored. But um, this one, I'll definitely go on an X and on Rumble so that uh, I will not get censored. But it is absolutely horrifying seeing babies being aborted that way. So, I don't know about you, if you have any sense in your mind about human life. Um... You might want to watch that video. Um, it's pretty graphic, even though it's animated. But it's also very, very sad what they do to uh, aborted children or fetuses. Or how many late-term, full-time, first-term abortions. Um, all I can say, it's very demonic. It is very evil. And... Um, It's kind of like their life source and why they need to feed uh, people out there because they get themselves, they give themselves a rush when they actually take it. And when they take it, they feel like they are summoned and possessed by Moloch or whatever you want to call them. And if you believe in evil, demonic then you know the opposite of evil is good angels jesus god so it is a spiritual battle like in all my other videos i'm always going to put spiritual battle in between because this is the fight for your soul fight you for humanity and it's now being amped up even longer faster and now 2000 24 is is here and you're seeing the political realm being absolutely obliterated by the good patriots the god-fearing man and woman and uh jesus christ is playing on his hand and uh it is happening the spiritual battle is happening and stay tuned because it is going to be a glorious ending but it's also going to be a rocky ride and it's also going to be a little bit you're going to hear feel a little bit of turbulence because they're going to kick and scream because they are not going to go down with a fight they've been ruling this place for over a thousand to two thousand years when uh when they nailed jesus christ on the cross when they crucified him until then it has been hidden behind the veil they've always been hidden and now they are being surfaced and now they are being exposed because of their minions being so cocky and arrogant of all the power and money they had for so long that they keep uh, exposing themselves okay and we only got Portis 45, which I'm talking lingo, so read between the lines. Who started and gotten the balls rolling. And I'm telling you, it's going to be a glorious 2024. But it's also going to be a rocky 2024. So buckle up and watch and learn about what's really going on in the world today. And how evil humanity is on this earth. 
but it's also a lot of good. So it's a battle between good and evil. It's always been a battle between good and evil. And the evil forces are right now being exposed. Just look at Biden, for instance. He's kind of a malfunction. His face is melting. He's talking gibberish. He doesn't know what's left and what's right. He doesn't know what. <laughs> he doesn't even know where he's at half the time, and he doesn't even know um, if he's president or not. For crying out loud, it's absolutely embarrassing, and it's absolutely horrendous watching a man like that taking charge of the most powerful country in the world. And uh, but it's good because he's being exposed as well. God has uh, a way of exposing things. God has a way of showing things. And God has a way of helping humanity. But it's us. Because he gave us free will. To fix the problem we have caused. But when things get rocky and gets worse. Then he will interfere. He is God. <laughs> That's just the way it is. Whew, man, I'm telling you, just watching these two videos, I don't even know what to say, um, kind of got me, kind of got me to that mind, mentally, physically, emotionally, about even uh, watching um, that piece of being afforded, how they utilize the organs, uh, I guess to help... Um, uh, making antidotes, viruses help, but do they need to do that with with the babies? You know, being aborted, and why are they being aborted? Why are they making it legal? You know what I mean? You're you're basically saying you created a human being, man and woman, right? So together as one, and you're creating a baby. And then if you don't like the baby, you're going to abort it. And then you're going to chop it up. It's, to me, it's absolutely disgusting, to tell you the truth. And uh, they use it for their uh, heinous acts. Okay, To me, that's evil. Now, there's no ways about it. If you don't think that's evil, then there's definitely something wrong with you. And if you don't think that is evil, then you might want to <laughs> get yourself checked out. You know what I mean? So... And why would you want to drink yourself? Uh, why would you want to drink a drink? What are you? What are you, Draculas? You know, it's basically blood. Hemoglobin or drained out or something like that. And all the, I don't know. I don't know. I'm no science. I'm no uh, doctor. So all I've seen is that they're very, very, it's, it's a high commodity in Hollywood, in the entertainment industry. And they make them look younger when they take it, I guess. They look vibrant. They get this adrenal like a dream rush and uh i don't know it just seems very very demonic it just seems very very evil just the whole thing about it is evil the more you know the more you learn you need to pass this and forward to everyone you know so i'm just one piece there's other podcasts out there but i want to go deep 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 underground what really want to figure out what's really going on in this world today and how they're using and utilizing uh, the babies as they abort it. And now that video that came to me pretty much explains everything in a nutshell. So, okay, I'm going to leave it the way it is that. And I'm going to throw up. <laughs> but anyway, thanks for watching me. Don't forget to hit me up on my Spotify, LA Entertainment TV podcast vlogging. Check me up there. LA Entertainment TV on my YouTube channel. And my Instagram, LA Entertainment Podcast Flag as well, too. So this will be on all these platforms except TikTok because I got zapped. But uh, for those of you who are on my TikTok or my subscribers and friends, I will probably put up another one and I'll let you know. Okay, guys, so thanks for watching. Don't forget to crush that like button for it to everyone know. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now. God bless. Godspeed. See you in the next video.